Games of the 30th Olympiad in 2012 are awarded to the city of London. We've done it! London have won it! The objective is to make the track from the sounds of sport. We literally started this process over a year ago, and now we have in the brightest of minds in Britain working on how to deliver the best possible experience that you will see in the Olympic Park. This is quite unique, bringing the performance into buildings and to use that to tell the story rather than to sing it as just architecture. And we can now build up this multi-layered experience that creates something that is more than just the sum of its parts. We're looking to find around 300 bright, smiley brand personalities to come and work with us at the Olympic Games. What beat, what sound? We have a very difficult job of weeding it down to pick people to do the actual work they've got ahead of them for the Olympics. Can't wait to get onto the Olympic Park and, and uh, start doing this with them. Our building is like a musical instrument, and like any musical instrument, it needs to be tuned until it's perfect and is, is really enjoyable to play. What you see in front of us is a result of a year's research and development. We've got an antenna which picks up uh, the proximity of the human hand inside a subwoofer integrated into the, the structure of the material, and LEDs which, at the same time illuminating the building, also respond to touch. It has been an amazing, amazing experience, to be honest. So just go out and kind of entertain the, the crowds, not just kind of physically, but mentally as well. Openly showing that we're happy and hopefully people kind of share that experience with us as well. We've learned a lot in putting something like this together. We've never done anything like this before between the technology, the fusion of sport and music, architecture. We've got a lot of learnings to pass on to future host countries and I think the biggest thing is just making sure that you have brilliant people that make you look really good.